Yo, what's up YouTube and welcome back to another video. Now, tonight's video is super, super important guys. So make sure you watch the entire video on how to invest for ones to watch. Now, I believe the ones to watch is coming out this Friday. We do have 24 hours before every single person in the world has the game. So, what we're going to get into straight away is getting you guys hitting that like button. Let's see if we can hit 40 likes in the first 24 hours. That'd be absolutely amazing. Leave it in the comment section if these videos are helping you out, guys. So, let's get straight into this. What I've been doing at the uh, the current time is I've been trading with Oscar, um, Felipe, Anderson, and there's a couple others, guys. Now, with Anderson getting a Team of the Week, I believe it is. Yep, so he's an 84-rated Team of the Week now. His base card is out of packs. Now, if his base card's out of packs... Okay, that does mean that his card's going to become more valuable uh, over the time that it's not in there, guys. Okay, so let's quickly find him, which is there. Now, again, as you can see, this card is at about 4.2k. So he's actually still gone up because yesterday he was 3.2. So yeah, he's gone up already. So he's already rising. So it might be worth getting this card now. Uh, and then selling on probably Friday when everyone's trying to build, uh, buy them for their teams. Or, you know, maybe the uh, SBCs uh, that are out, the Hybrid Nations and all those sort of multi-pack ones. Uh, people are going to be needing this guy because of the Brazilian link. So, yeah, like I said, get this card and flip him on, guys. So, there's a couple others. The Costil, again, that's another one. The goalkeeper, he's quite uh, required in a lot of SBCs. Okay, uh, let's quickly go and get him. Again, he's probably around 3k as well. As you can see, he's already rising, which is beautiful because you guys need to be getting these cards right now. Um, so I'm going to put a bit on there for 2.1 and another one on there for 2.1. Now, I know there's one there at 2.5. I reckon you'll probably go above that. Okay, and hold these cards to about Friday. Uh, possibly Saturday when people will start doing the SBCs. Yeah, probably Saturday hold them off till then. Uh, so who else is there? There's probably there's another one here. Dest is another card um, that is going to be out of packs. He's got a team of the week. As you can see, he's already rising up to about 1.9k. Uh, so people are going to be using him with their La Liga teams. Okay, uh, who else is there? I mean, Smith Rowe could potentially be another one, guys. Okay, so let's just quickly uh, let's quickly get Rowe and have a look at his price. Uh, there he is now again. He's team of the week. So he's gonna be rising up now as you can see He's not rising that much at this moment in time, but he's definitely gonna be going so maybe pick up some of these at like a lower bit uh, lower bid if you can and Sell them off for about 1.2 uh, As you know keep them sorry keep them till Saturday and then sell them off uh, don't sell them off now unless you want quick profit uh, So what we're gonna get into is we're gonna get into some of this ones to watch trading guys and now you will see my coins are low. They're at 16k. And this is uh, because I've been investing. I've done some investing. If you're in my Discord, get yourself in there. Uh, you guys get you know, to ask me one-on-one -on -one questions or just, just help of everyone else in the uh, general Discord is, is insane. So as you see here, we've got Deco. Now, Deco a few days ago uh, was about 11k he was selling for. He's now selling for 15. And he's going to keep rising because he's out of packs. Uh, also, we got Aguero. Okay, again, Aguero is going for about 9 to 10k. He will go up when people start trying to buy their teams tomorrow. We've got lots of Hummels, Laporte, uh, a few Summers. Now, the reason we've gone for 85s, 84s, and 83s is because I believe they're going to bring out some SBCs to get a guaranteed ones to watch. And these cards are going to skyrocket. So we've gone for a few of those. But also, with that said, guys, you do have your Lionel Messi. And you get Ronaldo. Okay, they're going to be your ones to watch as well, which a lot of people can't afford. So their prices are going to jump up. But the boys of like Grealish, okay, he is getting a ones to watch, which is perfect because I picked him up for 3.9. Now I think his price has dropped a little bit. No, nope, he's going up. So this is the perfect time to buy a load of Jack Grealishes if you can. Okay, and the reason you're going to do that is again, he's going to be out of packs. So people are going to want this card or he's going to be required for an SBC or he's going to be needed in some sort of uh, sense of the word. So, yeah, they're going to pay more money. Some people have more coins than cents. Uh, also, Alaba. Okay, so Alaba is going to be another one. Now, I picked Alaba up for 11k. Okay, he is already on the rise, guys. 
uh, 13k there. Uh, yeah, about 13 to 14k. So again, pick up some Alibas. He will probably go extinct. Do not sell your cards until maybe, uh, maybe late weekend, maybe start of the week. We'll keep an eye on the market and we'll see how it's going. Um, also, I picked up some Volans because Volan was 800 coins. I mean, at what point do you say 800 coins for an 83 rated card is easy money? That card is easily going to be worth two, three, four thousand 4,000 coins at some point. So I picked a few of those up looking at the slightly later lines of profit. Now, obviously Stones, okay? Stones is not going to be a special card, but he is going to be required for a lot of people's teams. Uh, just because of the uh, the Premier League and his 70 pace, he is one of the quicker, low rater uh, cards. So yeah, definitely looking at some of those to be invested in as well. Uh, but this is the other thing, Richardson's as well, 2.3k. He is going to go up again come tomorrow, guys. He's going to be shooting up through the uh, the thousands. Uh, Martial's is another couple. I picked them up for 12.5k. Now I don't believe Martial got a team of the week uh no he didn't okay and he's definitely not going in the ones to watch so his base card will be in packs but they are going to be required as you can see there was one there at 12k on an open bid uh with like four or five minutes left so these again are worth money uh and i've got a few miscellaneous things now this is the other thing okay i picked up this guy here now he is actually almost double in price later on in the evenings guys so i picked him up this morning at about nine o'clock for 2.1k. Uh, there's quite a few of them here, as you can see. I think I picked them all for 2.1. Um, and we're going to be selling them on probably about 8, 9 o'clock tonight. Now, again, make sure tomorrow morning that you do exactly the same thing. But people will be opening rewards. So, straight away in the morning, you want to buy some of these higher cards. Uh, like your... Let's quickly go over here. Uh, to Martial's, uh, D-Guard, Wigdersons, Oscars again. Oscar needs to go up. So we, we picked them up for 4.2. I'm actually going to sell them on for 4.7. Uh, 4.8 actually. So I just met myself 500 coins profit just on that bit there. Uh, so you want to be picking up your stones and all that sort of stuff on the ma on the mass bid, guys. Okay, Because that's where you're going to get most of your profits. Uh, so let's quickly talk about some of these ones to watch cards. And quickly go through them that you should be investing in. Okay, They will go out of packs. Which means their money is going to get more valuable. So, straight away, we're going to go into our boy Lukaku. Okay. Again, this card here is going to be out of packs. Now, he is currently... I have no idea what his price range is. I've not even looked at him. Okay, he's uh, he's a lot higher than what I thought he would be. Okay, so we're looking at about 65k. So, yeah, when he comes out of packs, 60, 60k. Uh, so he will come out of packs. He'll probably rise up to about 80, maybe 85k. So you're going to make 25k profit on that card. Uh, so if you've got about 500k, maybe go for some of the higher ones because they will rise. Okay, uh, another one. This is the, Okay, so this here is, is a really good card. If you remember last year, FIFA 21, at the very start when the ones to watch come out last time. Okay, this card was a high required card. Okay, and this he is... He's already rising. There you go. So if we actually quickly look at what his price was uh, this morning. I'm going to go to his standard base card. Um, what was he this morning? It's not saying. Oh, okay. So he was actually... Jeez. He was this morning 95k. He is now... He actually, he's extinct. He's actually extinct, which is crazy. So there you go. So if you can pick up one of them, okay, you are going to make absolute bare bank, guys. Okay, uh, so someone else we're going to get into. We've obviously talked about Alaba and Grealish is uh, Jorginho. Okay, so we're going to go and get him quickly. We're just going to show you on, um, there he is. Again, this is going to be another card that you want to try and pick up. Should have got these prices before we started the video, but I wanted to get it out. Again, is this guy extinct as well? No. Okay, so he's he's 28k. Uh, again, he will probably rise to about 35, 40k. So you're looking at about 12k profit on this guy. Again, you want to look at maybe mass bidding and picking him up that way. 
Uh, so another one, guys. Th let's go for the lower ones quickly. Uh, so you've got Conate. Okay, again, this guy is going to go up a probably about a 1,000 coins. Um, but saying that, it's an easy 1,000 coins because he's going to be out of packs. You can pick him up now for about 1.5k by the look of it, 1.4. Uh, you'll probably be able to sell them on for about 2.5, 2.6. Uh, if not, maybe a little bit more, guys. So, again, as you can see, nice, easy money for the guys that have got a little less amount of coins, okay? Uh, also, you've got our boy... Uh, was it? Kambinga? Okay, so let's get him up quickly. We'll make this one our last one so I can get this video up nice and early for you guys to actually benefit from it. I have a few of these cards as well, guys. Unfortunately, I paid a little bit more. I paid about 2.8k. He is down to about 2.2, but it doesn't matter because he will go up, so I will make some money on him. Uh, I just won't make as much as if I bought them now, okay? Uh, so there you go, 2k. You kind of want to be selling this card uh, mid next week again, obviously, uh, Monday, Tuesday, or sorry, early next week, Monday, Tuesday, for, uh, for max profit on this card. Um, so yeah, pretty much that is, you know, majority of the investments that you should be doing. Uh, also, like I said, if, you, if you've got a little bit more money and you want to invest for those, you can invest for these higher rated cards that are going to be required for SBCs. Now, obviously ones to watch, we know previously last year that you had to do an 85 rated team and you would get like a, a ones to watch player pick. Or not sorry pick, but you'll get, a, uh, you get one and then it opens, you know. So who knows? the dog look at the dog trying to get on the cam here Beach me. um so yeah again you could go for these 85s or you could just go for the guaranteed money makers like Grealish, Alaba um who else have we got here I mean obviously Stones is a guaranteed money maker Martial easy and then Mullen as well guys um so yeah as you can see I've got loads of cards waiting let's get those up and go uh, so basically, as well, you want to go for the seven nations, the seven main nations, because of these SBCs. The price cap on them now is absolutely insane. So anyone that hasn't done the SBCs, unfortunately, you are going to be paying out your rear end to get them completed. Uh, to everyone that's done it nice and early, GG, guys, you, uh, you, you paid off on it. Uh, but with that said, I will upload another video tonight on filters, on how to make more coins ready to invest. Uh, but with that said, guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.